All right. Um, what you do with this problem is you go ahead. First off, you need to prove that the small triangle is similar to the big triangle. And all you need is two angles that are equal. And, yeah, let me move this around, make sure we get it. Okay, and right, you've got this angle here and these two angles on the side. So, two angles is all you need to prove two triangles similar. So we've got it. Those two triangles are similar. So what I would do second is I would draw the two triangles out physically. So, and it doesn't have to be anything fancy. Here's the small triangle. Might take just a minute for my board to catch up with me. And so this would be 4, this would be y, and this would be 6. That's the small triangle. And then the big triangle, just kind of draw it the same way. So here's the big triangle. Um, now this is 6, because 4 plus, you got a 4 here and a 2 here. You add them together, that's 6. The bottom is x. And the side... Is uh, 3y. Not 3y, right. It, we're adding, so 3 plus y. That's a common error, the whole 3y. Oh, so you put it 6 to 4. Exactly. You're, so when you set that up, that's why I tell you, draw them out, because it will help you set up the triangles um, easier. Because okay. now you know exactly which one is your, is your uh, uh, scalar factor. So as you set this up, 4 to 6 is going to be equal to 6 to x. Okay, and then just cross multiply and divide. So 4x equals 36. Okay. Uh, not on my planet. Oh, whoa, my bad. <laughs> nine. That's nine. Nine, right. So x is nine, unless I set something up wrong. But it looks like that's correct. X equals nine. Okay, and then the second for y, you do exactly the same thing. We'll just do it in a different color. Y. 3, right, y to 3 plus y, right? Three, 4 to 6 and y to 3 plus y. So let me try to remember that. 4 to 6 equals y to 3 plus y. And again, you can cross multiply that. So 6y, again, my board's got to catch up here. 6y equals 12 plus 4y. Looks like it, maybe not though. Minus the 4y. Oh, minus the 4y. Jeez. Board's going slow today. So 2y equals 12. Yeah, you were right. y equals 6. Yeah, there's other ways to do it. And this isn't the lock. This isn't the only way to do it. But that's don't know what I was But that's the that's the two x's and y's. But I encourage you, draw the triangles out. And then write in what goes where. And try not to confuse 3 plus y with 3 times y. They're not the same thing. <laughs> Don't do that. Okay?